Hey, let's talk about these uh, tires I got on my bike right now. So, I came out to do the Colorado BDR on a brand new set of Motaz Tractionator Adventure tires for my Africa Twin, right? These things, I would rate these at best a 90 off-road, 10 road, and that's being uh, kind. These are not a good tire over 55 or 60 miles an hour because it is basically an off-road tire. I don't know how the hell these got away with a street legal designation, but when you're going down the highway over 55 or so, you see all these knobs? Let me hold the camera still. You see all those flex? Dude, when you're doing like 65, 75 on the interstate to like say get from the Midwest to get out to the Rockies like I had to do, those th that's super sketchy. It lets It moves around a lot, and when the pavement's grooved, it's even worse. So that front tire, not a not a big fan. If you've got to do a lot of interstate traveling to get to your off-road destination, destination, not the thing. But as far as the off-road out here in Colorado, they're perfect. They're awesome. Dirt roads, gravel roads, rock, over pass. That's the tire. It's very really, really, really noisy too. The back tire is uh, holding up really well. Uh, I've got about, we probably got, I don't know, a thousand miles on them and uh 850 of that 900 of that was was highway and the treads are doing good uh they got a lot of bite they don't let they don't move you know they don't let the bike move side to side very much i think this tire is good i didn't really have any issues with this on the highway either but they are really noisy and this tire because these knobs have this separation in the middle make the front end really really sketchy on the interstate i replaced a pair of shinko 804 805s to put these on and honestly for me having to travel so much interstate to get here i think the shinkos are the better choice but off-road these are the better choice so that's my review so far after about a thousand miles